Hey everyone, hey guys, how are y'all doing? It's your girl Twin D and thank you all for being here tonight. Thank you for your support. Guys, if you don't watch any of my readings, my messages, I love when you watch the prayer. Because once again, you all know that we can't do this journey, we can't complete this journey without God. So in everything we do, we have to give God thanks, no matter what it is. Because without God, we won't succeed. But anyways, I'm happy that you're here, happy that you guys are supporting this channel, this camp, me. Happy that you're supporting each other. And I, once again, thank you so much for joining me in Let Us Pray every Sunday. And if I miss Sunday, I'll do it on Wednesday. All right? <laughs> so always keep a lookout for it, guys. If you want to talk to God, if you don't know what to say, we are a camp, we are a family, and that's why I do this. To remind us, as a reminder, that we should always give God thanks and we should always turn to him, pray to him, and ask him for what it is that we need. Because he's directing us. He's protecting us. He's providing for us. He's guiding us on this journey. And whatever you ask, it shall be done. Whatever two or more shall ask, it shall be done. And that's why I do this. So we can come together and ask God for what we need together, agreeing as one. So that God can grant our wishes. And don't forget, our wishes need to be selfless. <laughs> oh my God. Anyways, let's jump into our prayer, guys. And if you're new here, if it's your first time stopping by, I always tell you guys, just pretend like you're in a room with everyone in this chat tonight. Just pretend like you are seeing everybody's faces. Like you're standing in a circle, holding hand, praying to God. Just pretend like you're a family around the bonfire. Because this is a camp where we're ready to have fun, two, three, four. And help each other to work on our situation and help each other to remain strong, to remain firm, and guide each other so that we all are victor victorious on our journey. Anyways, guys, let us pray. And if you're like me, who don't know what to say when you're praying, sometimes we don't even know the words to say, what to pray about. Just say the Our Father prayer. That's the prayer that I say at every single day, at every reading that I put out. Say that prayer, because that's how God taught us to pray. All right? All right, guys, let us begin. Dear Father, our God, as I come before you tonight, me and the people in this camp, those who are stopping by, those who are planted here. Huh. Dear Father, our God, we want to thank you for life. We want to thank you for this beautiful gift that you have given to us. We want to thank you for this journey. Because without this journey, dear God, we would not have found ourselves. Thank you, dear God, for guiding and protecting us and our families during this time, this perilous time that we are facing. Dear Father, oh God, there are situations that we cannot control. There are things that we don't know how they're going to work out. But we are coming to you, dear God, as one, joining together as a family, praying to you, asking you for your guidance, your protection, your help, for us, your people, your servants, and our families, friends, our divine masculines, our divine feminines, their friends, their families, their children. Dear Father God, we want to thank you for all that you have done in our lives. Thank you, dear God, for saving our lives countless times. Thank you, dear God, for looking out to us for us thank you dear god for all the gifts that you have given to us the gift of sight the gift of knowledge the gift of understanding thank you god for the gift of speech 
everything you have given to us. Even the things that we have forgotten to give you thanks for. Father God, we are praying to you, dear God, to give us the strength that we need to finish this journey. To hold strong on this journey. Help us to realize the things that we need to heal. We need to release from inside of us. Because Father God, you are our leader. You are our master. You are the master of our lives. You are our savior, Jesus Christ. And we accept you as our Lord and Savior. Father God, we're asking you to search within us and see all the things that shouldn't be within us, all the things that we need to release, all our insecurities, all our negative desires, all our negative emotions, or negative thoughts all the negativity that's in our heart we're asking you please to help us to wash these negativity from our soul from our mind from our heart from our bodies because we want to serve you we want to do your will and in, in order to do that we know that we have to be this pure servant that you want us to be help us to realize that this journey that we are on is to make us clean and pure so that we can stand before you so that we can serve you so that we can do your will without any interference father god we want to thank you for our divine masculine for sending them into our lives because if it weren't for them we would not have seen all these things that we needed to change within us. If it wasn't for them, Father God, we would not have improved on ourselves. We would not be prospering as we are right now because it's their energy that's pushing us to do better for ourselves, to realize our self-worth, to acknowledge who we truly are. And if the masculines are here, dear God, I know that they will thank you as well for their divine feminines. Because we allow their eyes to be open, to see truth, to see real, to see all that's good with them and around them. For them to release what does not need to be in their lives as we also give them the strength to follow their heart's desires and take those leaps of faith towards their dreams, towards their desires, towards their purpose, towards serving you. Thank you, God, for all the supporters of this camp. Father God, I want to thank you for all the people who have joined this camp and those who are about to join and those who will join in the future thank you God for sending them my way so I could teach them about you so I could show them what their journey is about how to heal themselves and who is the center of their journey thank you God for giving me this seat this position to work on your behalf. Thank you, God, for the strength to face what I face each and every day, to continue to teach your people and to bring your people back to you. Thank you, God, for everything you have given to us, everything that we have and everything that we are about to receive. Thank you for coming into our lives, Jesus. Because without you, we won't succeed. Thank you again for guiding and protecting us on this journey. Thank you for guiding and protecting our masculines while they're away from us. 
Thank you for answering our prayers of guidance and protection for them, for our families, our children, our friends. Thank you, God, for hearing our prayers tonight. And we want to ask you to continue to look upon us. Continue to forgive us of our sins. Even those we don't even realize that we are committed. Continue to watch over your children, dear God. Continue to protect us. Continue to help us, support us. And send us those signs and guidance through your angels to keep us on the right path and the right direction. Thank you, God, for all that you have done. And we know you're going to do more, and we thank you for those as well. As you taught us to pray, our Father who art in heaven, Hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come. Thine will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. And forgive us our trespasses. As we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation. But deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory. For ever and ever. Amen. Thank you everyone for being here. Thank you for your support. And like I, I said to you guys, sometimes when, you, when you're going through things and you, you, you don't know what to pray, just say the Our Father prayer. That's how God taught us to pray. And He knows, He sees, and He feels, and He hears you. And He knows what's in your heart. And He will comfort you. Take care of yourselves, everyone. Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, good night, good twilight, good whatever it is where you are. Let go and let God, everyone, and I'll see you tomorrow at your messages. Don't forget to subscribe, guys, and after you hit that subscription button, make sure you select that bell to be notified, and then select all. So you got to press the bell. So you can see the option to select all or you won't get all the, the videos that are posted. For a reading or the book, that one, that pretty one right there. Go to twindy.flamed.square.site or your protection bracelets, money magnet bracelets and your incense. Go to twindyholisticboutique.square.site. Let go and let God everyone. Later. Love you all.